An often overlooked area in design in Fusion 360 is a surface environment. Today what we're going to do is make a plastic shell enclosure for this thumb drive so it can be mounted to a piece of cardboard. We'll use the surface environment for this task. We'll start out with a simple sketch on a plane which I've created down the center of the part. I'm going to project two edges to give me something to measure to. Draw me a two-point rectangle around the part. Add some locating dimensions. and a small distance from the bottom, 64th. Of our height will be 7 sixteenths. Now, we're going to switch from the modeling environment to the patch environment, which is what the surface environment in Auto Fusion 360 is called. I'll go to the Create and I'll extrude that sketch to make a surface body. Do it symmetrically, a distance of 7 eighths, which gives me a new body with four surfaces. Next thing I need to do is close in the sides. I'll use the patch command. It's a top level command. Repeat for the other side. We now have six sides. But they're all, not all independent. Three of them are together and two of them are separate. What we need to do is stitch them all together. Before I do that, I need to remove the bottom so I can have an open side in this clamshell. So I'll just delete it. And now I'm down to five sides. Go ahead and pick my stitch environment. Pick on the three that are joined and the two sides I added. I now have a solid surface body of five sides. The next thing I need to do is add filleting to the corners of this surface because a plastic clamshell would have rounded edges. So I'm going to go back to my modeling environment and pick on rule fillet. Makes it very easy to place all these fillets at one time. Put a wind around it all and I'll just choose an eighth which is already set to Next thing I need to put a flange around the bottom which will hook to the cardboard. So I make a new sketch on the origin plane XY. Project my corner and draw a line quarter inch long. Now I'll go back to my patch environment and pick up sweep to sweep that profile along the edge of the part creating a, another new body surface. So there's a new surface. I need to stitch that into the other body. So I go to stitch, pick on that and the other surface and join them together. Now I'm back to one body. I need to add a fillet that edge and I'll use an eighth inch. So now this is more or less finished except it has no thickness. It's all surfaces. So we need to thicken it. So I pick on the thicken command, pick on the surface and I'll change it to ten thousandths or whatever thickness the plastic is. It's a new body. Now we have our body which is a solid, no longer a surface, we need to make it clear plastic. So I add my acrylic clear to it and I'm done. So you've now designed your clamshell cover 
for your thumb drive mounting onto a piece of cardboard using surfaces. I want to thank Dale Snyder for supplying the thumb drive model from GrabCAD. Thank you.